Hello everyone, Matthew here. Today we are going to be building a stock replica of the Ares-1 rocket. The Ares-1 was part of the Constellation program, whose goal was to return to the moon in two separate launches, where an Ares-5 rocket, which was very similar to the SLS, would carry a lander and Earth departure stage into low Earth orbit. The Ares-1 would then launch, carrying a crew of three astronauts aboard the Orion spacecraft into orbit as well. The vehicles would then dock, and the rest of the flight plan would be very similar to that of Apollo. Unfortunately, the Constellation program was cancelled in 2010, and the Ares-1 only got as far as a prototype, the Ares-1-10, which was successfully launched on October 2009. So the build process is pretty self-explanatory, but I will take a moment to list out all the keyboard shortcuts that I used to make this easier. X to toggle symmetry, C to toggle angle snap, WSAD to rotate parts, and when using the offset tool, uh, normally there is a limit to how far away from the parent part you can move pieces, but when you hold shift while using the offset, offset tool, you will be able to go beyond that limit uh, as much as you want, so that's very useful. And there we are, crossing the T's and dotting the I's by setting up action groups for both abort and solar panel and antenna deploy for the Orion spacecraft. So after I built this rocket, I went out and tested it and found a few problems. So first of all, the skipper engine on the second stage wasn't really powerful enough to push it all the way into orbit. And second of all, the fairings covering the Orion spacecraft didn't deploy, which meant that the spacecraft was unable to properly separate away from the second stage. So here you see me just making some final changes to the rocket, as well as adding additional fuel tanks to the Orion spacecraft. And there we have the Ares-1 complete. If you would like to fly this craft for yourself, then I highly recommend you check out my Discord server where the craft file will be posted. Also, if you enjoy my content, then please do consider subscribing, as it really helps me when you do that. Thank you and have a great day.